I'm Noah from MRP, and today I'm going to show you how to swap the 50 millimeter quick release axle in your ribbon fork with our slick bolt on option. To do this swap, you'll need safety glasses to protect your eyes from uh, wayward circlip, a pick with an angled tip, and a torque wrench with a 6 millimeter bit. It's also handy to have just a regular 6 millimeter Allen tool. And you'll also need in this procedure either your existing wheel or a boost hub um, as part of the installation procedure. Now you can do this process either with your fork installed on or removed from the bike. To begin, remove the wheel and axle from your fork if you haven't already. Now it's time to put on your safety glasses. You'll want to position the circlip so that it's visible in the notched portion of the dropout. Once there, use the pick to get up, uh, to get under the circlip and begin to pry it out of the dropout. Circlip out, you can remove the nut. Next, install the bolt on axle into the non side drive side dropout and begin threading on the nut by hand. It's sometimes helpful at this point to squeeze the fork legs together to help thread it on. Give the axle two to three rotations by hand to begin pulling the nut into the dropout. Now remove the axle and install either your wheel or the hub into the dropouts. Reinstall the axle and using your torque wrench or your six millimeter Allen key, begin tightening the axle so that the nut is being pulled into the dropout. You'll want to tighten to 15 Newton meters and then back it out a couple of rotations and tighten it again to make sure you've hit 15 Newton meters. With that, your installation is done and you're ready to go ride. Be sure that you check that the axle is tight to 12 to 15 Newton meters for each ride and enjoy your MRP ribbon fork.